Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Meli. If you have been with me for a while now, welcome back. Today I'm gonna be doing my basically everyday makeup look. Very like soft eyes, kind of just like brown. And my skin routine has changed a lot, so I kind of want to do like a separate video. Quick little side note, just want to thank my friends at Maven Beauty and Fashion Nova for sponsoring this video if you follow me on Instagram if you follow me on TikTok, you see me use them constantly to a point that someone like made a comment they were like um do you use anything else because all I see you is using Maven Beauty I don't know how I feel about this red it's just like really 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 bright like it's even brighter in person than it's coming off on camera but whatever we're gonna work with it so first things first I'm going to go in with the Maven Beauty rose water prep and refresh spray this one right here and literally I don't even have that much left that's how much I use this thing so I'm just gonna go ahead and just bathe in it so I also asked you guys to drop down any questions that you guys have for me on oh my god I hope you guys can hear all that noise that's going on outside any questions that you have for me I asked you guys on Instagram and on TikTok as well so I'm gonna be going through a couple of those things while I do my look I'm sorry this smoothie that my mom makes is so freaking bomb like I'm obsessed with it so I'm gonna just go in with a little bit of concealer just go ahead and cover up these dark dark eyes I feel like I haven't been on YouTube in such a long time guys and I really apologize honestly I just been lazy if I really want to be honest and it sucks because Sometimes it's just the editing for me that takes me so long. I edit my own videos, so sometimes I just be like, damn, I will have to like take two days just to edit one video, and it's it's a lot. But I promise myself this time, I know I say it every time I like disappear, then I come back and I'm like, oh, I'm back, I'm back. But this time I promise you guys, I'm gonna try to be more consistent and um, just post more often because you know I miss you guys and I like just sitting here and talking to you guys it's different than Instagram even TikTok like people don't get to actually get to know you or like really even sometimes even hear your own voice but on here like I feel like I can like bye bye with you guys and you guys can really get to know me I'm gonna go ahead and take a little bit of loose powder and just um, set that real quick a lot of people they don't set their concealer I am not one of those people I need to set it if I don't, my eyeshadow will move everywhere and I don't like that. So a lot of you guys actually were asking about my fillers and Botox and if I had like eye surgery and things like that. So I do get fillers. I got like the Bot Botox um, brow lifting, whatever it's called. It does give you that like snatched kind of look. I actually got the thread in my nose, which I regret so, so, so much. I was supposed to get it on my eyes, but I had just applied a fresh wig. So they were like, no, you gotta come with like your wig off because they really gotta get like back here. All they said was the wig needed to come off. And I had just applied it like hours before I went there. So I was like, uh, maybe next time. So then um, they were like, well, we can do it on your nose and like lift your nose up and blah, 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 blah. And I was like, okay, cool, I'll try it. Girl kid you not like eight months later the thread is on the side here like if I go like this I literally can feel the thread over here so it made my nose look crooked thank God to my friends Laura at fix me up that she was able to correct that with filler and like give me that like straight even though you still look looks a little crooked or whatever but girl I'll take what I'll take so um, she was able to fix it with filler. And yeah, what else? You know, I get lip fillers, um, I've done cheeks, I've done jaw. Even though I've been chilling off the jaw and the cheek. So I'm just going into the crease and I'm using the Maven Beauty Medium Blend Eyeshadow Palette. That's literally my favorite palette from them. The colors are so perfect as you can see, like the perfect transition shade everyday colors and you can actually build them up and I'm just taking that same shadow and I'm just going back in just on the kind of like the outer part of the eye and just kind of like building that crease up a little bit someone asked me on TikTok and they said are you planning on having any kids soon um am I planning on it no um 
if it happens obviously I feel like kids are God's gift do I have like a plan am I trying to get um pregnant right now no I am not next I'm taking that light kind of like baby pink shade on that same palette and I'm just gonna dab that oh my god I really hope you guys can hear these dogs are out of control so I'm just gonna tap that on my lid mostly concentrated like towards the inner part of the eye once it starts getting towards the outer part I kind of just want it to fade away and I'm using the defined eyeshadow brush from Maven Beauty as well. I don't know if you guys know, but Maven Beauty is partners with uh, Fashion Nova. So it's really, really convenient because you could just purchase them from straight from the Fashion Nova site. But I shop at Fashion Nova so much. It's, it should be a crime. My top right now from Fashion Nova. So it kind of does look like a cut crease, even though I said I was over the cut crease or whatever. I meant like the super, super defined ones, at least for my everyday look. So I'm going to take that same blending brush I took for my crease, and then I'm going to just tap on a little bit of loose powder on it and just kind of like go over the outer part of the eye just to make it even softer. I'm going to run that a little bit on the inner part of the eye as well, just to like get rid of any sharp lines. I'm sorry if I keep looking this way instead of this way is my monitor is right here and I'm just like staring at myself so I'm taking that same defined eyeshadow brush and just tapping a little bit of whatever's left on the brush on the lid just to really make that kind of pop so next I'm just taking the Maven Beauty bold beat eyeshadow palette and I'm taking a small pencil brush just to kind of create like a smoky um, kind of cat out. I'm gonna end up dragging it out not too much for the inner corner I am dragging it in as well but I'm not taking it up as high. I really really love how easy to blend these eyeshadows are and just the overall tones of the eyeshadows is very very like everyday like I said earlier. So someone asked do I regret getting any surgeries? The only thing that I did to myself that I really kind of hate that I did was get that thread in my nose because it really didn't help with anything and now it just makes my nose look crooked but besides that everything else I did I pretty much always wanted to fix that so once it got fixed I really don't want to go back at all I feel like once you you know you don't like something about yourself and you finally get to fix it it's unless like someone gets you botched it's the only time that I will be like damn I'm just gonna be cleaning up this area because I know you guys are probably like what in the world and this is also gonna give you like that lifted effect so now I'm gonna take a black pencil and I'm just going to kind of like just like smudge it on my lash line just to make it like a little bit darker in this area I'm gonna go ahead and go in with the small cream eyeshadow brush from Maven Beauty just go back and forth just to kind of smoke it out I'm gonna go ahead off camera and just do my base. Please let me know in the comments if you guys want me to do an in-depth foundation, but that's another thing. I don't really use foundation anymore, so just like a updated base routine. Let me so I pretty much did my entire base. The only thing that we're gonna be doing now is adding some blush. So I'm gonna be using these two. They're both from Maven Beauty. One is in the shade Crush, and the other is in the shade Cultured. And when I am telling you these they knew what they was doing with these like these blushes hit different the whole collection is just bomb look at how gorgeous that is so i'm going to be going in with the refined powder brush from maven beauty and i'm going to start up at the cheekbones and like blend it into my bronzer as well look how gorgeous that shade is oh my gosh then i'm going to bring it into the apples of the cheeks once my nose is done baking, I'm also going to put a little bit on the nose and they kind of have like a little bit of shine in them, which I love because lately I have been obsessed. Great, now there's a helicopter going by. I have literally been obsessed with like dewy skin. I'm going to go back into that medium blend and I'm going to just take that same shade that we use on our lid and I'm going to just apply that to the inner corner just to open up my eyes because... So I went ahead and popped on some lashes. Now, the hell? Now we're just gonna move on to lips. I don't know what's been going on with me, but I have an obsession with like pinky, almost red lips. I have been doing that for months now. I'm just taking a pencil brush and just blending that in. 
I'm going to clean the border of my lips with a little bit of concealer and that same Maven Beauty angled brush just to clean the edges. Cause girl, I hate when the edges look sloppy. Next, I'm gonna take the Maven Beauty lipstick in the shade Stunner, and I'm just going to tap that. I'm not gonna swipe because these lipsticks are literally no joke, they're so pigmented. So if I swipe, it's gonna be too much. I don't really, I want it to look more like a stain, not like I apply lipstick. This is so pretty, like their lipsticks are bomb. However, your girl always has to add gloss. Oh my God, this is such a pretty pretty combo we're not done yet now it's time for setting spray i'm gonna go in with the maven Ro maven rose maven beauty rose water setting spray and i'm just going to bathe in this Ooh, smells so good this is the final look i really really hope you guys enjoyed watching this video i didn't get to answer as many questions as i wanted to i don't know i just literally got lost and forgot that i was supposed to answer the questions so if you guys want me to do another like get ready with me and just like catch up just drop whatever questions you guys have for me in the comments and i will do another get ready with me and just answer them because a lot has went on in my life like a lot a lot a lot that i don't even speak about i really hope you guys like the look it's not nothing like too crazy it was pretty simple pretty basic kind of look but it's literally my go-to i'm gonna be listing down in the description box all the products that i used in today's video most of them were from maven beauty which is exclusively sold at fashionnova.com you guys are the best i love you guys so much and i'll see you guys on the next video